Thanks, Barry. Well, there's nothing better than kids in costumes raising money for our furry friends all at the same time. Today, Hancock County Schools held their 11th annual Halloween for the Hounds fundraiser. Students, teachers, and staff members at each school donated money and dressed up in their spooktacular costumes. Monetary donations from every school benefits the hounds and cats at the Hancock County Animal Shelter, and they raised over $4,500 from this year's fundraiser. Assistant Principal Carla Carasini Bell created this fundraiser back in 2013 and says it's been wonderful watching it grow each year. Have so much fun with the kids, and I think everybody was ready to have some fun. And we have a parade, and our PTA does a lot of activities for the kids. And uh, we have the animal shelter here with us, and we're really excited to have them. And hopefully that um, the kids can learn to be kind to animals and to do some community service and to help each other out. It's amazing just having all the kids give to the shelter, and um, it helps us with our spay and neuter programs and enrichment for the animals, and it kind of gets the kids involved in animal welfare, so it's kind of exciting to see them happy and excited to do it. It's absolutely awesome. We get a lot of, uh, lot of good stuff for the animals. Uh, they get a lot more help during this time, which is nice because it gets cold out pretty soon. You know, so this, this gets them out there, this gets the word out, raises awareness, and it's a great thing for all the animals involved. 7 News reporter Annalise Murphy was invited to Weirton Elementary this morning where she got to see zombies, unicorns, princesses, police officers, and even Taylor Swift walk the halls at Weirton Elementary during their Halloween parade.